Hello, beautiful people. Thank you so much for tuning in. And if you're tuning in later, welcome. So having a few technology issues, so I appreciate your patience here this afternoon. Last week, friends, we were really working um, to lean into our core strength, into our power. And this week, our focus is going to be on finding the stillness beneath the mental the beneath the mental chatter, the love and the joy that exists beneath our discomfort. We're doing a lot with the heart. And so we're gonna actually play during the vinyasa today with some vibrations and with some frequencies. So if you had the chance to do the breath work video that I posted on Saturday, you kind of know what I'm talking about. Vibrations and frequencies have a primal effect on the body. Anybody who loves music knows that that's true. So let's just practice the vibration we're going to work with today because I'll cue it a lot throughout our flow. You ready? Cool. Take a deep breath in to ground. And a deep breath out. Good. Breathe in. Yum. That's our sound. Yum. Y-A-M. The sound that the heart resonates with. So whenever I cue it, do it out loud or do it in your mind's eye if you're not comfortable with that today. With that being said, beautiful friends, grab two blocks and a strap if you've got one. If you don't have a strap, absolutely no worries. You can use something like the sweater that I have on my body right now. You can use a pair of sweatpants. I am gonna get our playlist going. And as I do so, please get settled in child's pose, Balasana. Come to your mats. Bring your big toes to touch. Spread your knees out wide and lower your third eye space between your brow against the floor. Sucking into this shape. Celebrate making it here to your mat this practice. It's invite a connection between yourself and the earth in these early moments. Take a deep breath in through your nose. And a breath out through your nose. And then another breath in. Exhale, yum, yum, yum. Okay, return to your normal breath. Walk your head from side to side. And take Two more yams together. Breathe in. Yum. One more breathing. Yum. Settling to stillness. Big breath in through your nose. Big breath out through your nose. Inhale, tabletop pose. Shift weight forward. Stack your shoulders over your wrists, your hips over your knees. Inhale, cow pose. Drop your belly, reach your chest. Exhale, hover cat. Tuck your toes. Push through your palms. Let your heart squeeze skyward. Inhale, hover cow, drop your knees, keep them lifted up your mat, open through your heart space, pull your shoulder blades towards your spine. Exhale, downward facing dog, at home, Kashmanasana. Press your heels towards the floor. Resist the urge to move here. Rather, challenge yourself to observe the shape you're in right now. Push each finger, each toe firmly into the floor beneath you. Put another breath in through your nose. Breath out through your nose. Mm. Send some light down through the backs of your legs. Now, rock weight from the left to the right, just moving your hips. 
Just sending more weight into the opposite heel. Avoid bending in your knees yet. Good, just starting to open up the lower back. Now, bend into your left knee. And bend into your right knee. And repeat that twice more. Study those subtle shifts in the body. And knee back. And downward facing dog. And inhale, look to your fingers. Exhale forward, fold steps softly to your raised hips. Feet rather hip width distance apart. Bend into your left knee, plant your left palm. Inhale, rectal twist, reach your right arm to the sky. Throw your wrist here in both directions. Take a big breath in. Big breath out, change. Bend into your right knee. Plant your right palm. Inhale. Right out, twist. Send your left arm to the sky. Roll your wrist to the left and to the right. Take another breath in here. Breath out, right out, pose. Fold at your waist. Send weight towards your toes. Maybe grab your opposite elbows as you rock from side to side. Send more weight into your toes. And then into your knees as much as you need to here to bring your palms to the earth. Welcome that connection, that grounding energy. Walk your feet in towards one another so your big toes touch. Inhale, standing at attention. Slowly step, bone on bone. As you rise, draw your shoulders up to your ears and then release them down your back. Bring your hands to heart center. Push firmly through the soles of your feet. Squeeze your glutes to activate your belly. Take a breath in. Prepare for yum. Yum. Inhale, mountain pose, the last one. And that vibration up towards the sky, out to the yogis, flowing here with you, inviting us all to connect with our heart space and the light within. Take a breath in here. Breath out, gentle back bend. Knee towards your heels. Go post your arms. Lift your chest up as if I were pulling your heart space towards the sky with a string. Inhale, mountain pose. Reactivate your glutes and core. Exhale, forward fold. Draw your hands through heart center. Let your practice be a devotion. Inhale, pull your feet out wide. Inhale, ragdoll twist. Let your left palm send your right arm up. Exhale, change. Bend into your right knee. Send your left arm to the sky. Breathe in. Good. Breathe out. Tabletop pose. Plant your palms. Drop your knees to the floor. Inhale. Cow pose. Lift your heart. Exhale. Hover cat. Tuck your toes. Lift your heart. Space sky. Inhale. Hover cow. Drop your knees. Lift your chest. Exhale. Downward facing dog. Finger into this moment. Take a breath in through your nose. Breath out through your nose. Good friend. Second and third round. We'll move breath to movement, riding our breath like a wave. Here we go. Inhale, look to your hands. Exhale, forward fold. Step or float to your wrists. Inhale, halfway mid, bring your palms to the mat or to your shins or thighs if that's not accessible today. Exhale, fold. Inhale, sound to tea. Rise, bring your hands to heart center. Exhale, yum. Inhale, mountain pose, and your arms up. Exhale, gentle back, bend, lift your chest. Inhale, mountain pose, and your hands skyward. Exhale, forward fold, soften down. Inhale, ragdoll twist. Spread your feet out wide. Exhale, change, bend into your right knee, send your left arm up. Take a breath in. Breath out, tabletop pose. Inhale, calm, lift your heart. Exhale, hover cat, tuck your toes, push through your palms, inhale, hover cow. Lower your knees, keep them lifted. Exhale, downward facing dog, Anjali towards the back of your mat, breathe in here. Breathe out here. 
Last time, inhale, low to your hands. Exhale, forward fold, step or float to your wrist. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, sound is deep in heat. Rise with purpose. Exhale, yum. Inhale, mountain. Exhale, back bench. Inhale, mountain. Exhale, forward fold. Spread your feet wide. Inhale, ragdoll twist. Exhale, change. Inhale, lift your left arm. Exhale, tabletop pose. Inhale, cow, lift your core. Exhale, hover cow, tuck your toes, push through your heart. Inhale, hover cow, lift your gaze. Exhale, downward facing dog. Take a breath in through your nose. Breath out through your nose. Inhale, up to your hands, friends. Exhale, forward fold, step or float to your wrists. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, some deep deep rise. Hop into the vibration. Make another breath in here. Exhale, yum. Inhale, mountain. Lift your palms. Listen for the change. Bring your hands to touch. Exhale, reverse namaste back then. Pull your thumbs to your spine. Draw your elbows in towards your ears. Continue to lift your heart space towards the sky. Inhale, chair, hold. Lower your hips towards your heels. Check in with your knees, see that they're behind your toes. Pull your pelvis in to activate your belly. Release your shoulders down your back to invite more space through your heart. Take another breath in. Breath out to your plane. Send your hands behind you. Pull your hands above your hips. Draw your pinkies towards your spine to open through your chest. Bring weight into your right foot. Inhale, one-legged mountain pulse. Lift your left leg off the floor. Find that point in the room that isn't moving. Your gaze, your drishti. Press through your standing leg to invite more length. Take a breath in here. Breath out, low lunge twist. Release your left foot behind you. Reach your right arm to the sky. Press through your toes. Just straighten your left leg and welcome a deeper stretch through the back of your right hip. Inhale, warrior one. Your Adrasana one. Draw your right arm down and up. Flatten your back foot against the floor. Step it in a footprint if your heel is lifted. Should form a 45 degree angle or so. Commit to a stronger bend in your right knee. Let your right hip back in space. Pull your left hip slightly forward. Take a breath in. Gaze towards the sun. Gather that loving energy. Exhale, revolve to warrior one. Work to pull your left elbow outside your front back. Press through your palms to deepen your twist here. And to lift your core off of your front leg. Take a breath in. And a breath out, push through your palms, twist up, gaze past your right elbow. But listen here, friends, pivot onto the ball of your left foot. Inhale, crescent lunge, Anjaniasana, lift your fingertips. Sink a half inch deeper in your right knee. Work to lengthen your back leg to activate your quad. Take another breath in here. Breath out, open arm twist. Send your right arm behind you, flip your palms up towards the sky to receive the abundance you so deserve. Work to reach your fingertips away from one another to broaden through your chest. And now bring your right hand to your booty. Inhale, exalted warrior. Send your left hand behind you towards your back heel. Big breath in. Big breath out. Low lunge. Launch weight forward. Bring your right foot with your palms. Inhale, high plank pose. Step your right foot to the back of your mat. Exhale, low plank. Rock forward on your toes and bring your shoulders level with your elbows. Always the option to drop to your knees if you need to. Inhale, upward facing dog. Press through the tops of both feet. Squeeze your shoulder blades towards one another. Exhale, downward facing dog. At home, mukha, breathing. Breathe out. Inhale, three-legged dog, lift your right foot in the air. 
As you join your right knee to the pit of your arm, lift it as high as it'll go. Inhale, lower your knee towards the floor. Exhale, lift. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. We lower and lift for four. Shh. Three. Shh. Two. Shh. And one. Downward facing dog. Breathe in here. Breathe out here. Inhale. Look forward. Exhale forward. Both step and glide to the top of your mat. Inhale. Halfway lift. Exhale. Fold. Inhale. Samas deep thinking. Rise. Anchor through your heels. Connect with that vibration. Take another breath in. Yum. Good. Friends, inhale. Mountain pose. Bring your palms to touch. Exhale, reverse down the stay back bend. Hug your elbows towards your ears. Lift your chest. Inhale, chair pose. Sit low. Pull your pelvis forward. Drive your knees behind your toes. Squeeze your glutes. Stay active. Take another breath in. Breath out, chair plane. Sweep your hands towards the back of your mat. Drive your pinkies in. Lower a half inch more. Direct your focus to your left foot. Shift right there. Inhale, one-legged mountain pose. Lift your right leg off the mat. Flex your right toes towards your face. Push firmly through your standing leg. Take that breath in. Breath out, low lunge twist. Release your right foot to the back of your mat. Send your left arm to the sky. Push through your palm. And we're just straighten your back leg to keep that quad active. Inhale, warrior one, there of a drasana one. Drop your back foot to the floor. Form a 90 or 45 degree angle here. Sing a half and sheep on your left knee. Edge your left hip back and squeeze guide your right hip forward. Breathe in, lift to the sun. Breathe out, revolved warrior one. Work to hook your right elbow outside your front thigh. It's okay if your elbow is resting on the knee of your leg. But if you can deepen that twist, Use it as leverage, right? Press through your palms to spin your heart space up to the breath and lengthen. Breath out, twist open, gaze past your left elbow. Good. Now listen in, friends. Keep it onto the ball of your right foot. Inhale, press and lunge, dungeon yes, now lift your fingertips. Lower a half inch more. Activate your right quad. Lengthen through your right leg. Take a big breath in here. Big breath out, open arm twist, and your left arm behind you. Lift your palms up again to receive the abundance that you deserve, the abundance that is coming to you. Reach your arms in opposition, open through your chest. Yes, friends, now bring your left hand to your booty. Inhale, exalted warrior, send your right fingertips towards your back heel. Take a big breath in. Big breath out, low lunge, lunge your weight forward, bring your front foot with your palms. Inhale, high plank pose of your left foot to the back of the mat. Exhale, low plank, shoot the round, the rock weight forward, lower your shoulders 90 degrees. Again, option to drop to your knees. Inhale, upward facing dog, earth back. Squeeze your thighs to lift them off the earth. Exhale, downward facing dog, up, hold. And if you're down, big breath in. Big breath out. Yes, inhale. Three-legged dog. Lift your left foot to the sky. Exhale, draw your left knee to the pit of your arm. Pull it up as high as it'll go. Inhale, lower your knee to the floor. Exhale, lift. We lower and lift. Lower and lift for four. Shh. Three. Shh. Two. Shh. And one. Downward facing dog. Breathe in through your nose. Breathe out through your nose. Good, friends. Second round. We'll move a little quicker. Tapping in to the rhythm of our breath. Tapping into vibrations and frequencies. What's your self-talk sound like right now? Find the meaning in the challenge. Yes? We have look to your fingertips. Exhale, forward fold, hop to your wrists. Inhale, halfway lift, expand. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale, arms to the heat. Exhale, yum. Inhale, mountain, send your arms skyward. 
Exhale, reverse Namaste back bend. Pull your thumbs to your spine. Inhale, chair pose. Sit low. Exhale, chair plane center. Hands behind you. Inhale, one legged mountain pose. Lift your left leg. Exhale, low lunge twist. Send your right arm up. Inhale, warrior one. Round your back foot, rise. Exhale, revolve, warrior one. Work to hook your left elbow outside your front thigh. Inhale, crescent lunge. Put it on the ball of your back foot. Exhale, open arm twist. Send your right arm behind you. Pumps are up. Exhale, exalted warrior. Bring your right hand to your booty. Breathe in here. Breathe out, low lunge and wait forward. Inhale, high plank. Exhale, shift the run Inhale, up, down. Exhale, down, dog. Yes, you can breathe in. Breathe out. Inhale, three legged dog. Lift your right leg. Exhale, draw your right knee to the pit of your arm. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Lower and lift. Lower and lift. For four, three, two, and one. Downward facing dog. Breathe in. Breathe out here. Inhale, look forward. Exhale, step or float to your hands. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, sound. Rise with purpose. Exhale, yum. Inhale, chair, get low. Exhale, chair, plane. Send your hands back. Brother, inhale, mountain pose. Exhale, reverse. Now the same back bend. Can't forget it. Inhale, chair. There we are. Exhale, chair, plane. Inhale, one like mountain. Lift your right leg. Exhale, low lunge twist. Step your right foot back. Inhale, warrior one. Grounded anchor. Exhale, revolve to warrior one. Hook your right elbow outside your front thigh. Inhale, crescent lunge. Rise up. Exhale, open arm twist. Send your left arm behind you. Inhale, exalted warrior. Bring your left hand to your booty. Reach your right arm back. Exhale, low lunge. Inhale, high plank. Exhale, shoot the wrong guy. Inhale, up dog, erva. Exhale, down dog, ad ho. Inhale, three legged dog, lift your left leg. Exhale, draw your left knee to the pit of your arm. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift, lower and lift. Lower and lift. For four, shh, three, shh, two, shh, and one. Down, way facing dog. How are you doing, beautiful yogis? Third round. Listen for the changes. We'll continue to activate the energy of our heart by connecting specifically with the power in our hips, where we harbor our emotions. We're working to find that stillness in our presence. Can you find it right here, right now? Drive your heels towards the floor. Push through your fingertips. Breathe in through your nose. Breathe out through your nose. Inhale, look up. Exhale, forward fold. Hop to your hands. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale, sound deep heat. Rise. Exhale. Yum. Inhale, mountain pose. Exhale, reverse. Namaste, back bend. Inhale, chair pose. Get low here. Exhale, chair plane. Send your hands behind you. Inhale, one legged mountain pose. Lift your left foot up the mat. This is going to change, friends. Exhale, figure four. Cross your left ankle over your right knee. And begin to lower towards the earth. The lower you get, the more intense the stretch will become. So find your edge and push towards your edge today. If you want to take this a step further, option to work towards a twist, hook your left elbow outside the sole of your left foot. You can work to stack your elbow on top of your wrist to deepen your twist here. Bring weight into the big toe of your standing leg. Squeeze your core. If you're in your twist, 
Return to center. Woo. Inhale, one legged mountain pose. All right, lift your left leg. Exhale, low lunge twist. Plant your left foot, reach your right arm up. Bad friends, inhale, horizons lunge. Send your right arm behind you. Lower to the knife edges of both feet. Push through with your palm. Avoid sinking in your left shoulder. Hug your right bicep to your bone. Stay as active as you can. Exhale, low lunge twist. Send your right arm back up. Inhale, warrior one. Ground and anchor. We played with energy and frequency earlier this month. So we're going to play again with it. But this time, just simply using that heart chakra activation, using the vibration yang to lean into our heart space. You ready? We'll take a breath and gaze up. Exhale, yum. Send that vibration up your fingertips. Inhale, pull it into your heart. Exhale, yum. Last one, breathe it. Yum. So good, friends. Inhale, warrior one. Exhale, revolt, warrior one. Hook your left elbow outside your front thigh. You can stay right here, or you have the option to lean into your strength. So if you have the twist and you feel stable, begin to lengthen your right arm forward and your left arm beneath it. Palms face one another. Work to spin your heart space up. Drive through both feet. Take a breath in and a breath out. Twist. Good. Inhale, reaching crescent. A change here. Send your fingertips forward. Ah, sink deep in your right knee. Lengthen your back leg. Big breath in here. Big breath out. Open arm. Twist. Send your right arm back behind you. Lift your palms towards the sky. Last time you're here on this side. Make it count. Can you create more space through your heart? Yes, you can. Inhale, exalted warrior. Bring your right hand to your booty. Reach your left fingertips back. Exhale, low lunge. Send your hand forward. Inhale, high plank pose. Exhale, Shadaranga. Inhale, up that earth back. Exhale, down that up. Hold. Listen for the change. Inhale, three like a dog. Exhale, active pigeon pose. So create an outer V shape with your right leg. Keep your back toes tucked here. We're still pretty early in practice, so we don't want to completely descend towards the floor. We just want to unpack some of the stiffness that exists in our outer right glute. If you want to bring a little more into the stretch and there's no sharp pain in your knee, option to gently lower your heart to the mat and then rise back up. Do that twice more. Leaning into your authenticity, your own sense of rhythm. Mm -hmm. Inhale, three like a dog. <laughs> Send your right leg to the sky. Exhale, down, we're facing dog at home. Mukha. One more side, magic souls. Breathe in through your nose. Breathe out through your nose. Inhale, look to your hands. Exhale, forward fold by to your wrists. Inhale, halfway lift length. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale, samastitihi. Bring your hands to heart center. Exhale, yum. Inhale, mountain pose. And that vibration up. Exhale, reverse namaste back bend. Lift your chest last time. Good. Inhale, chair pose. Get low in your chair. Exhale, chair plane. Swing your fingertips behind you. Inhale, one legged mountain pose. Lift your right leg off the mat. Exhale, figure four. Cross your right ankle over your left knee. And descend towards the floor. And the deeper you get in this shape, the more you'll increase sensation. So find your gaze and move towards your complete expression. If 
You want to invite a twist. Do so now. Work to hook your right elbow into the sole of your right foot. Press through your palms to support you as you spin your heart space skyward. Beautiful yogis. Keep your belly active. Send weight towards the big toe of your standing foot. If you're in your twist, return to center. Inhale, one leg mountain pose at your right leg. Exhale, low lunge twist. Send your right arm back. Reach your left arm to the sky. Inhale, horizons lunge. Lower to the knife, edges of both feet. Gonna avoid sinking and caving into your right shoulder. Push through your palms. Reach your fingertips towards your back heel. Take a breath in. Grab that low lunge twist. Inhale, warrior one, flatten your right foot against the floor, rise. Let's play with that vibration, that frequency once more. Breathe in here. Yum. Good. Breathe it into your heart. Send it out to your neighbors. Send it out to the yogis. Yum. God, breathe it in. Send it up to all living things. They can all use it right now. Yum. I inhale, warrior one. Exhale, revolve to warrior one. Work to hook your right elbow outside your front thigh. You can stay here. Play with this twist. This is a big expression. Or if it's available to you, begin to lengthen your left arm forward and then your right palms face one another. Use the strength of your core, the openness of your left hip to support you as you spin your heart space up. Breathe in. Breathe out, twist. But inhale, reaching crescent. Send your fingertips forward. Hug your biceps to your balls here. Exhale, open arm twist. Send your left arm behind you. Reach your fingertips towards your front toes, towards your back toes. Inhale, exalted warrior. Bring your left hand to your booty. Reach your right fingertips back. Big breath. Big, big breath out, low lunge. Inhale, high plank pose. Exhale, shoot the lung. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, three legged dog. Lift your left leg high. Exhale, active half pigeon on the left. Lengthen your back leg behind you. Tuck your toes. Form an outer shape with your left leg. This creates any sharp pain. Just stay in down dog or come to your backs. But if you can move a little further, softly lower your heart towards the earth. And then rise back up. Repeat that twice more. Feeling into your body. Connecting with your body right now. And we'll meet in downward facing dog in three, in two, in that one. Take a big breath in, friends. Big breath out through your nose, friends. Inhale, look to your hands. Exhale, forward fold. Step to your wrist, take a seat. Grab a quick drink of water if you need it. How are my beautiful yogis feeling today? Namaste, great, okay. If you have a strap handy, grab it. If not, grab a jacket, grab sweatpants, whatever you have, they'll serve the same purpose, a scarf. Lower to your back and loop your scarf, <laughs> your sweatpants, whatever you've got around the sole of your right foot. Take your tool in your right hand and draw your toes towards your right shoulder. Take a big breath in here. Big breath out. Recline to the head to toe pose. Send your right leg away from you and gaze left. If your left hip begins to elevate off the floor, take your left hand and press your hip down. Three cleansing breath cycles here. And your third breath cycle. Lift your right leg, 
Take your tool in your left hand, move to recline, revolve big hand to toe, pull. Send your right leg past your heart. Gaze towards your right fingertips. It's so important here that the shoulders are connected with your mat, so don't worry about whether or not your toes meet the earth. Focus in on the back of your heart. Pay attention to that space. Anchor it into the mat. Find that sense of stillness, that sense of comfort. One more big breath in here. Big breath out here. Lift your right leg up. Change sides. Send your right leg long. Loop your tool around your left foot and draw your toes towards your left shoulder. Take a breath in. Breath out. Recline to the hand to pose at your left leg. Fall open. And again, if your hip lifts off the floor, take your right hand and press your pelvic bone back down. Three breath cycles here. And friends, lift your left leg. Take your tool in your right hand. Move to recline. Revolve big hand to toe pose. Gaze towards your left fingertips. Check it with the back of your heart. Notice if it's lifting. Glue it back down. Welcome this opportunity to connect with the pulsing, healing energy of Pachamama, Baniju. Take one more big breath in. Big breath out. Lift your left leg. Place your tool to either side. Draw your knees into your chest. And then rock and roll the length of your spine up to a seat. Cross your ankles. Meet me in puppy pose. Spread your knees wide. Not quite as wide as child. Walk your hands forward. Bring your chin towards the earth. Maybe lips and nose to the mat if that creates some strain in your neck. If you have a particularly tight chest or particularly tight shoulders, you may find some comfort in taking a pillow and resting it beneath your chest. It's going to allow you to open the same way that I'm opening here, but maybe in a safer way. It's so important, friends, that we take advantage of using props and tools, especially when we're flying from home, so that we can continue to come back to our mat and grow. Remembering that this is a progression, not a perfection. Remembering that the journey towards transformation is a journey, right? It's ongoing. Same here, friends, for three more breath cycles. We're to funnel loving kumihashi through your shoulders down towards your fingertips. And the end of your third breath. Rise to tabletop pose. Inhale, tuck your toes. Exhale, downward facing, da da ho, mukha. Inhale, three legged bubble. <laughs> Lift your right foot to the sky. Exhale, low lunge. Stab your right foot far away. Inhale, warrior two. Spin your back heel down. Drive firmly through the ninth edges of both feet. This is the first time we've been in this familiar sense of power this class. So I want you to really tap into your strength. Sink a little deeper in your knee. Widen your sense if you can. Draw your shoulders up and then down your back. Put your biceps to your bones. Inhale, straighten your right leg. Exhale, triangle pose. Trick the asana. Send your right arm towards the earth. Left arm to the sky. Work to drive through the back edge of your left foot to spin your heart space towards the sun. 
Stay here or reach your arms forward, palms face one another. Tapping into our core. My friend, so strong. Take a big breath in and a big breath out. Twist and open. One more breath in. Reach. Breathe out. Twist. Inhale, warrior two. Then back into your right knee. My friends, exhale, extend mid side angle. Reach your right arm down. Send your left arm to the sky. Use your right arm as leverage. Gaze towards your top fingertips. Take a breath in here. Breath out wide like a forward fold. Slowly with control. Draw your left hand down. Parallel your feet with the short edges of your mat here. Take a moment to just breathe. And then walk your feet in a little closer. As close as you need so that you can bring opposite hands to opposite ankles. Right arm on top first. Inhale, roll under your right arm. Open up through your side body. Getting deep down into your right hip even. Big breath in here. Good, big breath out, change sides. Bring your left arm on top, roll under your left bicep. Big breath in. Big breath out. One more, breathe in here. Breathe out here. Send your feet back out wide. Form T with both arms. Inhale, start pose. Rise to stand. <laughs> Exhale, warrior two. Open back up. Inhale, crescent lunge. Pivot on the ball of your back foot. Exhale, chair plane. Step your left foot to meet your right. Send your hands behind you. Inhale, one leg mountain pose. Lift your left leg. Exhale, figure four. Get low. You can stay here, friends. Or you can play with grasshopper pose. I'm going to face you so you can see me. So the first layer is to work our left tricep to the sole of our foot. Maybe you just focus on figure four. Maybe you focus on the twist. But if you want to take this a step further, bring your hands outside your right foot. Shut them on the distance apart. Bend into your left knee and work the sole of your left foot to your tricep. Option to bend into your elbows, stay right here, or maybe begin to flow your right foot off the floor and lengthen your right leg long. If you're sweaty, you can always bring a towel or a sweater to the back of your left arm to give you a little more grip. Take a few moments to play. One knee back. In one leg of mountain. Pose in four, in three, in two, in one. Inhale, one legged mountain pose. Exhale, low lunge. Inhale, high plank pose. Exhale, shoot the run. Well, need two more. This is one of them. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, down with facing dog. Beautiful friends. Take a breath in through your nose. Breath out through your nose. Now three-legged dog, lift your left leg this time. Exhale, low lunge, step your left leg forward. Inhale, warrior two, anchor into this stance. Press firmly through the outside edges of both feet. Reach forward, reach back, inviting you to be here, present in this moment. Be here right now. Squeeze everything to the midline, lengthen through your spine. Inhale, lengthen your left leg. Exhale, triangle pose, trikonasana, send your left arm to the earth, right arm to the sky. Again, ground into the outside edges of both feet, stay here, or send your arms forward. Take the core challenge, breathe in, lengthen, breathe out, twist open, breathe in, breathe out, one more big breath in, big breath out, inhale, warrior two. Then back into your left knee. Exhale, extend it side angle. Set your left arm down. Reach your right arm up. 
Use your left arm as leverage to spin your head space towards the sky. Take a breath in here. Breath out by leg it forward, fold with control. Lower your chest towards the earth. Option to take that side body stretch that we did on the first side. Or option to keep this white stance. And if it's accessible to you, lift your heels, scoop your hands underneath your heels. Bring your third eye towards the earth. Video, now halfway lift. Form a T with both arms. Exhale. On your inhale, rise up to star pose. Yes, take a breath in. Breath up, warrior two. Inhale, chair. Well, where did we go here? Inhale, chair pose. Woo! I don't know. Exhale, chair plank. I'm just having fun with you, friends. Inhale. One-legged mountain, lift your right leg. Exhale, figure four, cross your right ankle over your left knee, and get low. Option to stay. Layer two, option for your twist. Or layer three, option to move towards grasshopper. Bend into your left knee, plant your palms. Work your right foot as high on your right tricep, so go. Bend into your elbows and lift your left foot off the earth. One side may give you a little more trouble than the other. This side is always a little more challenging for me. And this is a challenging shape, so enjoy whatever layer you're at. We are all growing together, and I'm so thankful you're here on your mat. Woo! Okay. Enjoy this moment of play. We'll return to one legged mountain. Pose in three, in two, in one. Inhale, one legged mountain. Exhale, low lunge. Inhale, high plank. Lashataranga. Treat it with love. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. At home. Breathe in. Breathe out here. Inhale. Three legged dog. Lift your right foot in the air. Exhale. Half pigeon on the right. Form an already shape of your right leg. Lengthen your left leg long behind you. Tip over your shoulder. And when you're ready, bring your chest down towards the earth. If this pose causes any sharp pain in your knee on Either side, come to your back. Take figure four on your back. Otherwise, we're to breathe through the discomfort. The more attention we bring to our breath, the deeper our awareness becomes. And the same is true of vibrations and frequencies. So as we lean a little more intentionally now into the center of our creativity, where we harbor or tend to harness our stress and fears, I'm gonna invite you to lean back into that vibration young. And if you get off of my rhythm, that's okay. On your exhale, lean into that sound, Take 
return to a gentle breath. Take the tension out of your shoulders. Just see where you can soften a little more. And the breath in through the nose. Big breath out through the nose. When you're ready, rise up. Shake out your right side, form circles with your right leg. Option to flip dog, bring your right foot outside your left, drop your hips, or maybe wild thing, bend backwards once more, reach your right hand towards the earth. Return to downward facing dog, take a breath in, and a breath out. Be healthy like a dog, lift your left foot high, exhale half pigeon on the left, Ekapanarasha, Kapopasana. Lengthen your right leg low behind you this time. Check over your shoulders. See that your back leg is straight. Move to your chest. And then when you're ready, lower your heart space towards the floor. And take a moment to settle in before we lean into our vibrations, but if you're already yummy, then awesome. Activate your heart. Avoid friends feeling all weight into your bent left. Ready to level your hips, draw your right hips slightly down. Breath in through your nose. Breath out through your nose. Let's activate that vibration, breathe in. Restorative. 
Use your breath to support you in melting into this moment. Let your head hang heavy. Breathe, ujjayi breaths. Rest out through your nose. Witnessing your life expand in a joyful way, in a victorious way. Embracing and walking confidently into the unknown. Recognizing that you yourself move through any challenge with grace. Slowly begin to lift your chest, final posture. Before Shavasana, of course. <laughs> Form L's with your hands. And bring your thumbs in toward your glutes. Lower your forearms towards the mat, lift through your chest, and then allow the top of your head to descend towards the earth. Avoid collapsing in your shoulders. Press your heart towards the sky. One more yam here, everything. Yum. Hold that frequency within you. Take a breath in. And on your breath out, move to your Shavasana. Let your palms fall open. Your tongue fall away from the roof of your mouth. Be here for a few moments, friends. Keep you out when we're ready. Namaste. 
Mm, namaste, beautiful friends. Thank you so much for joining me here at the beginning of your week for investing in your practice um, and for investing in a sense of presence right now. I hope that you feel a little lighter um, and a little more connected to joy and to your innate essence. Um, I'm so thankful for you. And in the description, in the comments of today's video, I've given you all three different mantras to focus on in this practice um, and throughout the week, just in day-to-day -day life. These are some things that I will, that I think will help you um, harness your energy in a positive way. So I hope that it's beneficial to you. Please send me your feedback. Let me know how you're feeling in this journey. And if you have any requests for what you want to focus on in your body, because I'm doing this for you. I'm doing this for the collective right now. This is something that brings me so much joy. And so if I can help you connect with your body and create a sense of peace within yourself right now, then I feel like I'm winning. B. I love you with all my heart. If anybody wants to shout out in the comments, I'll leave this open for another minute. But may all of you have a wonderful afternoon. And if you're tuning in at a totally different time, thanks for being here. All my love to all of you friends. Tomorrow, we will be practicing yin. Yes. So see you on your mats again soon. Thanks, friends.